How big would I need for a kitchen? What kind of things do I need? A butcher's table, which is three. And a food prep table. It's another... Is that two or three? It's two. Oven? That's also two. Fuel stove is three. So I'll need at least a three, because I could put one of the threes on each side, and then I could put twos on the other side. Okay, let's kind of get an idea of that. Oh, is there anything else I might need in there? Uh, the milling stone and stuff like that we can figure out as time goes on. But first off, we have the twos. Oops. Not like that. But the twos here, this could be the walkway in. So there are those two. Uh, should I put a space there? Because then I could put threes right there. Have a bit of extra space in case I need to expand later on. I might need additional things. Now we can do three, put something in the middle, three, two, two, two. Alright, I think that's... That'll be a good size for a kitchen. And then a storeroom right behind it, which we'll need to also touch down here. So, could do it right there. Actually, that's going to open up, so who knows what'll be out there. Should I put it like that? Because I'm going to end up digging that out. Although, this could also be a door. Uh, sorry, I'm just thinking to myself and I'm not giving enough information, probably. So this could be where I put the um, AC to cool the room off. Then I could put an outside door. Or the other way, I don't know. I'll, f I'll figure that out as time comes. But the main idea is that we'll have a nice big room for all of our storage needs, for our refrigerant needs. And I'm also going to put a pantry for like dry goods storage, things that won't go bad. And that can just go a bit more interior. Should I put, the, put that bigger? Yeah, why not? And they can put a door across. Oh, I just realized that I could actually move this one over because that wall right there. Should I also plan for um, ventilation? That might be wise. Wait, okay, let's cancel that. And move that up. Pull that out. That down. Actually, do that. And make it go farther back. Because then I could put a pantry back here. Do that there. Oof. Maybe across the hall. No, it, it should be connected. I'm gonna eventually make a oh, like a a tunnel for air conditioning and climate control and all that to go through. So I'll probably just pull that from down here and go up and around, or maybe just go across and. I don't know, I'll figure it out. But I do want it to go behind different rooms. Should I make it too wide? I guess that would just waste more power if I do it that way. Oops. Not that. And I could also run pipes through here for uh, water, because we're going to have to do water as well. Oh, look, and there's water right back there. Oh, 
So that could even be the outlet. We could pull water in from here. And... Could... Actually, where's the, um... River? Because we're also going to need a, um... Sewage outlet. Which would go into the river. The river flows that way. Okay. Where is our water at here? Because you can pull water up from the ground as well. Uh, what was it under? Hygiene? Spoiler, new water tower. Oh yeah. Oh, I can do it in here too. And that could just be a sewer lagoon. <laughs> could I build that there? Where is the sewage outlet? Doesn't look like there'd be quite enough space. I mean, I could do it right there. Just use this as a nasty sewer lagoon. Uh, I'll figure out where I could pull water up from. Maybe back there, just because it is, uh... Because I can't put it, like, right there. Now, that, that's gotta be it. How big is the large water tower? Oh, it covers quite a bit more area. But still, that... That's a good spot. So, approximately there. Kind of... Boop. Okay, let me get... The plan. It goes about there. Hygiene. Water tower. Yeah. How much space do I need? Probably... Four or six, maybe? I know it can't go like that, so I'll have to do it this way. That can be our water intake, then maybe we can convert this into a water out. We just remove some of this other crap. What's all this green? Schist. Okay, so next... I put up here? Uh, I'm gonna need bedrooms. Oh, I could put bedrooms along this, and that way that they'll be um, nice and aerated from that. 5x5 five five room? another 5x5. Five five. Can bring that up and then use some ventilation to cool the hallway. Or heat the hallway as needed. So we've got five of us. One, two, three, four, five. And an additional because we will eventually need that. Actually, I'll need a large room for Matthew and, uh... Oh crap, and I'm forgetting about bathrooms. Where would I put the bathrooms? <laughs> I feel like I'm playing The Sims, almost. Alright, forget this. So if I have a double bed in here, I need to expand that a bit. And they can have a double bed, they can have their end tables, maybe a dresser over here. That can be the way in. I'll put that right there. And a bathroom. So they have enough space for um bathtub, maybe a shower, toilet. That's probably enough for all their all their stuff. 
Mm, is that the size I should make for a bathroom, typically? Maybe so. Okay, now. There, and, uh, another five. Although I could also fit bathrooms in like that. So somebody's just going to get another nice bathroom. Or because the two of them are going to be sharing one, maybe I'll just double up their space. So that's one, one, two, three, four, five rooms. And an additional... Eventually, we'll need more. We can bring that up and around. We'll do it this way. So everything should be touching. That should be easy to put ventilation between. long hallway for that and then I can bring this around and this could either be more rooms or it could be um, like I don't know it could be something else let's see how much space would we actually need if I convert this all the rooms should I make this a th three hallway oh so spacious big plans big plans And I can just put something in the middle and then two doors. Yeah. Sorry, this is just me throwing down plans. <laughs> Hopefully it's not terrible. Um, yeah, then we can pull this back around here. So we can ventilate all of the potential rooms that'll be up here. Do that? Yeah. And these will all just be built as needed. Should I put that there? No, I shouldn't. I should keep with the uh, theme that I've got. Oh, there we go. Okay. So that's the residential block. I shouldn't need to go off over here. Okay, then... This way... Oh god, there's so much space. That way I can put in, um, I'll need regular storage, so just a basic storeroom, which I could put close to the opening, I could even do that from right here. We always have way too much crap, so make it huge. Oh wait, no, we should put the kitchen, or not the kitchen, the uh, dining room close. So the dining room should be across from here. Um, how big should a dining room be? Wait. A table for five people. So then, could put it kind of in the middle, make two with some stuff around it there and maybe some other crap along the sides. I don't know, let's make it spacious and we'll just fill it with stuff as we need to. There we go. And 
You can also put joy things in here too, like TVs and stuff eventually. You can use this set. No, instead of storage, this could be a greenhouse. Oh yeah, let's see. How much space will we need for greenhouse? So we'll need a planter, two planters, planter, two planters, plant two planters, two, two, two. And then one there. Planters are three long. So I have a hallway between three and oh look at that. That is that's gonna be perfect. So then you'll have walkways here and walkways up and down. And that relatively close to there, so people can run through the kitchen to uh, drop stuff off into the different storages. And I don't want this to become a thoroughfare, so I won't put one here and one up there, it's just down here is how you get in. Okay, storage. Oh, but actually I'm going to need the... Um, Ventilation. So ventilation will come up through here. Because this will be a separate shaft. This one will cover that side. Our regular storage probably will not need to be all ventilated. And it can become a thoroughfare, so there can be an in here and an out that goes into the hall. Is there anything else I might need up in here? A research room, maybe? Okay, and that'll help cool the hallway. Since I didn't have one that over on the other side to cool that hallway. Oh, yeah, I'll put that there. Hopefully that's enough space. How big are the... Um... The... Tables... Oh, I just have the simple one right now, and it's only three? I think five is the uh, the big one. God, it's been a while since I played this game. Well, then there'll be space to put something in on the side. There we go. Can fill that in with other stuff as needed. Can have other workstations in here. So, three for a work table, three for a work table, and then I can put like a light or a plant or something in the middle. Okay, that's, that's our current plan. 